Hold on. That shit's dumb loud. You already know it's your girl King coming back at you. With another motherfucking YouTube video. Yeah. I don't know if y'all hear that outside, but they're outside doing construction. But what is good, guys? You already know it's your girl can't come back to you on that motherfucking YouTube video. So I'm here. I'm back. I told you we are doing the 90 day challenge. What is that, King? I don't know what the fuck that is. What are you talking about? You always talking your bullshit. Listen, the 90 day challenge is I'm going 90 days with posting nonstop. I'm going to be posting 90 days, okay? Straight 90 days, a 90 day challenge is for myself and for us. We're doing this together as a team. For everybody out there that support me, that watch my videos on a daily basis, that know what I'm about and what not, it's a 90 day challenge for me. Help me, support me, share my videos, comment on the videos, like the videos, be active with me. It's going to give me that drive to continue to do these 90 days. Like, like I said, if you think I'm not going to post a video, make sure you snap me, Instagram me, tweet me, king. Where is the where's the video? You post it, you post it, you post it. And these videos are gonna either be up in the afternoon or they might be up late at night. But you will have a video even if it goes into the next day. You might have four videos in one day. You never know what's gonna happen. But I'm posting 90 days straight. This is not why I'm here. I am here to react to this the the whole fucking Chris and Queen and shenanigans that's been going on. I didn't want to talk about it because. You know, this whole cheating situation, it kind of hits home. So, I don't really like that whole cheating stuff, you know? Like, I don't really deal with that. So, I want to hear what's going on in Queen's life because I might feel her pain, you feel me? Like, I want to know what Chris did. So, it's time for us to throw on the shades because I'm about to get fucking shady as hell in this video. They're not even shades. I don't think they're tweet. This is definitely yo. I hope you guys are ready. I don't know who these girls are. This obviously there's one of the girls in the video he cheated on Queen with and we're gonna see which one the girl is. So yeah, let's let's get into this video. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? If you're new here, oh my god, I just started talking and whatnot. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button, become a part of the team, turn on my post notifications, blah 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 blah. I'm talking too much. Yeah, I'll do that at the end of the video. Let's, let's watch this shit. Hey guys, welcome to this YouTube video. I'm Jada. I'm Maya. I'm Helena, and we're here to address something that happened a couple days ago, um, which is really sad, and I know that's why you guys are here. We're going to get to explaining. Um, I Oh. Alright, so which girl is it? Alright, it's the curly head, John. You guys may or may not know of Chris. Um, Chris and Queen are is a YouTube couple. Uh, they're pretty much famous, almost uh, 2 million subscribers for their relationship. They have a little kids together. Basically, some stuff happened. Uh, how many days ago? Two days ago. Two days ago. Personally, Queen, no matter how much you're getting out of this relationship that you have with Chris, like, you honestly deserve so These much. These girls are, like, fucking 12 years the old. The story starts with the two of us. Um, basically, we got invited to the club. This club in downtown LA. No, was it in Hollywood? Yeah, it was in Hollywood. It was Friday night. And so we were sitting down at a booth, and I peeped like a guy over there, and I was like, oh shoot, like he's cute. He was by himself. Like I thought, I was like looking to see if he had a girlfriend around him or something. He didn't. But we walked like in front of him, and we were just like sipping our drinks, and then like. I saw that he saw her, so when he came up to us, he like whispered in my ear and he was like, am I ugly or something? And I was just like laughing. He was telling us like how he's single. Yeah, I, like, I asked him, I was like, do you have a girlfriend? He was like, no, I'm single. I was like doing this to Chris and stuff like that, just being like flirtatious. And he whispers in my ear and he says, I'm going home with the both of you guys. And I 
and started laughing like, you're crazy. And he like does this and he starts feeling on me and he's like grabbing my butt and I was really tipsy and kind of just delusional at that point and I look over but and he has this, his okay. hand on Lena's butt and he's just he's like this. holding the both of us. Okay, so fast forwarding, we were talking on Saturday, we were just texting and FaceTiming, and then he really wanted to see, uh, he said he really wanted to see me, so on Sunday, um, texting me that he wanted to come over, I was like, yeah, sure, like, why not, like, we can hang out and stuff with the girls, so he comes in and he's just like, gave me a hug. Okay, wait, I'm gonna stop this video right here right quick for this one quick second. You're telling me that you're in the club. One, these girls don't even look at age over 21. I mean, they could be because they're obviously in the club, but nowadays fake IDs exist. So, you're telling me that you didn't know that that was Chris from Chris and, Chris and Queen. And you're telling me that you didn't know that they was together. And you're telling me you don't watch their YouTube videos. So, you, you like... Okay. Flirting with me and grabbing all over me, and he was just like, Which one of you is a freak? And I was like, What? And then he's like, Which one of you is a freak? And I was like, What the hell? Like, what the hell is wrong with you? Like, how are you gonna flirt with the both of us? He started talking to us about his YouTube channel. We had a really good conversation. Mind you, we have no idea who Queen is. Yeah. Like, I mean, he can't never say watched this YouTube. He's just basically. Talking about how he has a baby mama and they're like good friends and they start YouTube together. So he's in it for like the money. Talk to us about how they fake their pranks and the money that they make from it, and that she's just like whatever. But like they kind of just are on the same page that they do all this for money. And now that he is not here, we have got the perception that he lied, and she seems to think that they are happily married. Yeah. We were never told he was married, he was single. He doesn't have a ring on his finger. No ring. He just made us think he did some YouTube with his baby mama, but they only did it for money, and they had this child together, and that was really all we got from the conversation. So the next day, Chris texted me, and he was like, I want to see you before I leave. And I was like, yeah, like, I want to see you too. Like, and then he was telling me, like, you know, he could stay another day. And he was just like, you should come to my hotel. He gets me, like, a margarita, and we're watching it. And, like, he's, like, all on me, like, kissing me. Oh, I'm guessing she was in the After the movie, he's like, okay, so you're going to come back to my place. And... Obviously, I was stupid, and I was like, I was, I got in the Uber, and then we ended up going back to his hotel, and, like, I was like, okay, like, how am I going to get home, and so, the stuff that happened is obviously what you're thinking, it's obviously, like, something that would happen to a girl that's just, like, drowned. No, hotel. wait. Like, you can, you can put the pieces together. Hold on. I'm going to touch on this situation right here. So, are you basically saying that Chris raped you? This, is that? And now, that's what I'm getting from that video. Things that would happen to a girl that's in a hotel drunk. A lot of things can happen to her in a hotel room. Because I've been in a hotel room drunk. And I never got raped. But it, when I tell you, the, the results of me being a happy person was... Amazing when I say, but listen, that's what I think happened. She just got fucked. Now moving on. Um, but it's really hard for me to talk about this because I actually really like, I actually really liked him. I fell for him. I fell for everything that he told me. And in two I fucking days, bitch. Like genuine man. Thank you for watching this YouTube video. Oh, we should call him. Oh, oh, we should call him. We should call him. Okay, I'm gonna call him right now. For what? Pick up, pick up, uh, my hey. 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 Yeah. Hi, Antonio. So, are you gonna come see me? 
Oh, it sounds like they're fucking tight, yo. I got so much to say about this video. Like, oh my god, I'm gonna need for you guys to give this video a big ass thumbs up. All right, smash down on that thumbs up button because what I'm about to say. Listen, all my Chris and Queen fans out there, listen. <clears throat> I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. There's no shade at all in this video towards Chris and Queen. Like, listen, my heart goes out to Queen because niggas ain't shit. That's number one. Chris, you know that you are this, this entertainer, this person with millions of followers, and you out here, you know that's your image, and you know... What can come from you fucking up and you doing a lot of stupid things, bro? Like, you, you should have known, my nigga. You should have known. You out here entertaining these little ass girls. And then these little ass girls get in their feelings, bro. They get in their feelings and they be mad. And then they start telling. Stop messing with these little ass girls. They ain't no good. They ain't right. They ain't shit. Now, bro, I, I don't approve of any of this. I'm disgusted in you, my nigga. You had an image to uphold. You gave me hope. You gave me some type of hope, my nigga. I, I'm, I'm so disgusted. I cannot believe this. But, listen, to each own. I, I hope she leaves his ass, to be honest. I hope Queen leaves his ass. Leave his fucking ass. I mean, there's a child involved. You can't really do that, but... Listen, you know what you're doing when you cheat, and that's all I gotta say about that situation. So, if you was feeling this video, make sure you give me a big ass thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, please, turn on my post notifications, please, and follow my social media, and that's in the description box below, and go check out my podcast that was done last night, if you haven't checked it out, link in the description box. Also, go get you some King TV merch, it's in the link description box below. Everything is in that description box, baby, you feel me? Uh, yeah, that's it, don't hate me, just love me, peace, love, and happiness, Make sure you guys stay back. Uh, okay, like bills on me blue. Uh huh, like a bruise. Uh huh, better yet. Uh -huh.